So I thought I was doing pretty good on my weight. Uh, last time I weighed myself, I was like 270. So I bought a new scale. Been doing yoga and some morning hit exercises. Don't think it's coming out too good. This is showing me at 263. So it's crap. <laughs> Absolute crap. So this morning, uh, along with the scale, weekly updates, and the worst one, the belly. There it is. It's ugly as hell. I'm going to post this to YouTube, and I am going to bust my ass to get that under 260 next Monday. I'll be doing two workouts a day in the morning time. I'll be doing either a HIT high intensity interval training exercise or I'll be doing um, jump rope which I just bought this awesome jump rope from Walmart and uh, we'll see how that goes I hate jump rope five minutes of it kills you and we'll see if my knees can stay up to it. One of the biggest drawbacks of all of this is my knees hurt every time I work out, so it's hard for me to work out. But we'll get there. In the afternoon, uh, three days a week, I'm going to keep with the yoga just because it helps a lot with all your functional strength, as I like to call it, just how standing for long periods of time yoga helps you with. And then I'm going to add in weight training three times a week. One day chest, one day arms, one day... Uh, chest and arm, chest and back, I'm sorry, and then one day legs. Uh, we'll see how this goes. The goal for next week is 255, all right? Yesterday was pretty good on the food. Morning time I had yogurt and granola and a couple eggs. Lunch was a smoothie and a hummus wrap from Tropical Smoothie, which in Southport is about the only place you can get a healthy lunch or healthy anything, really. Um, dinner last night was some sort of coconut quinoa curry, which was good, not very filling. There's lots of that left over. So this morning, again, yogurt and granola, because it helps my hunger issues. Uh, a couple eggs. Um, I'm going to do that coconut quinoa for lunch. Um, and then this evening, uh, Lowe's down here has some cheap frozen swordfish steaks. So it'll be swordfish, steamed vegetables. Um, and maybe a sweet potato, I haven't decided yet. Just kind of depends. I'm also going to start trying to do the snacks in between. Let's see, losing weight, like losing it properly, is this is about the fourth time I've had to do it in my life, like lose a lot, and it is hard. And now I have to deal with bad knees and just being old and preferring to sit around and watch TV. I don't have a lot of motivation to do it this time. So... Um, except for general health, I mean, being a nurse, you see a lot of people with obese issues like diabetes, congestive heart failure, and I have been getting dizzy when I eat any sort of junk food. Any junk food, I get dizzy. So what does that tell you, kids? Blood sugar issues. I know this channel is supposed to be toward barbecue and fishing, but one, it's been extremely cold in North Carolina. I took my big boat out yesterday, and I don't want to. I don't want to go out. It sucks. Um, I did order an actual real camera, so hopefully I'm gonna start posting more. But we're gonna start with the weight loss issues, uh, dietary. You see, the thing is though, grilled food is actually healthy for you, so you can actually do quite a bit. Um, just depends on how much uh, seasoning and what type of seasoning and sauces. So, but there is. Lots of grilled vegetables you can do, which are actually, in a lot of cases, yummier than uh, yummier than meats. So, um, I'm also going to be doing some wood projects. I just built a gate to my backyard, and I'll finish doing that. I'll post some pictures of that. But uh, I'm going to build a work deck or a work table and insert my uh, my grill in there out back so I can grill out back instead of my, in my driveway, which always kind of looks funny. Anywho, I'm going to go ahead and post this um, day one 
of the real start of my workouts. I've been, like I said, I've been doing yoga for about two months now just to get back to where I can handle workouts. And now we're gonna kick it up a notch. And whenever I get my new camera, which is supposed to be here tonight, I'll post some videos of my fat jiggling as I jump around everywhere. Um, but if you wanna be mean to me, be mean to me. I'm a fat guy. I went from pretty in shape to being pretty fat. It's pretty bad. People always wonder, how long does it take you to get out of shape? Sitting on your butt for four years we will do it. Four years. All right, guys. I'm going to post this. Um, I'll post you a video tonight and give you an update on what all I got done. Um, also, I'll show you some projects that I'm working on with the kayak. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.